Ph. Nina Rips had good intentions in purchasing half of the Metro building and giving it back to its former owners, Colley Corinthals, but because of Colley's selfish suspicions and aggressions, she pushed everything over the edge. There was never a complete conversation between Nina and Colley. That is especially true when both see each other as enemies. Colley made the wrong decision to help her son and Drew can merge the comedy. She died when her property. She should be grateful to Nina. Nina took the initiative to help her, but in her mind, Nina was a cruel enemy, and she never trusted Nina to help her. She thinks that Nina and her ex-husband have a plan together and want to be close to their grandson. Because of that selfish thought, Colley will regret why she rejected Nina. Viewers remember that in the past, Nina also wanted to confess Sonny's existence now saw a PC when he was resumed dead. But selfish Colley blocked Nina's throat with criticism. Nina then gets angry and decides to keep quiet, which leads to her hiding Sonny's assistant. Sonny's assistant. This time, Nina will repeat the same thing when Collie criticizes her again. She doesn't want to be the new owner of the Metro building. She even tells her lover that she really wants to give it to Collie. Collie refuses. Nina will sell it back to Valentin Casadai, and she can also sell it to Ava Jerome. Nina learns that Valentin used to be Collie's enemy during the comedy merger. She knows that selling Collie's property to him might not make as much sense as selling it to Ava. Since Ava is closer to Nina, Ava is also someone who has lots of money because she owns a part of Cassidy's property. In addition, Ava is also more suitable for the positions of her lover, of lover than Nina. Nina certainly does not want to own the newly acquired property. Nina wants to be more loyal to her position as Crimson's editor. She also received an offer from Drew Kian to become the the director of Crimson's, but she declined. Nina can sell Carly's property to Ava without telling the person she loves. Sunny would definitely be angry when Nina's important matter is related to his ex-wife. Nina decides, but she doesn't approve of Sunny. Sonny can sense that Nina doesn't consider him important in these decisions. Sonny might want to stay with his ex-wife rather than with Nina. After Nina's misguided plans, Collie won't agree to get back with her husband, but she still has feeling for him. She will agree to let him be by her side during difficult time like this, because she needs emotional support. Unfortunately, this will make Nina jealous. She's ready to take Sonny down and what she has with him. In the end, Nina and Sonny's relationship will end after this. He may get back with his ex-wife before before ex-wife reviews Nina and Willow Tate's relationships.